In today's Your Healthy Family, we're talking about what to do if you're bitten by a snake here in Southern Colorado with UC Health Memorial Emergency Medicine Dr. George Hertner. This is the time of year that we need to be aware that snakes are out and about. Uh, luckily, what we see in Colorado are rattlesnakes, and fortunately, some of the time, if they have the opportunity, they give you a warning that you're bothering them, and they rattle. When that happens, you need to avoid the snake. So let's see how much you know about getting bitten by a snake and what you should do if you are bitten. Should you A, cut the bite open, B, suck out the poison, C, apply a tourniquet, or D, apply a cold pack? The answer is none of the above. You don't want to fall into the trap of all the myths and things that you've seen on television. You're not going to cut the bite. You're not going to suck on the bite. You're not going to put a tourniquet on the bite. You don't even need to put a cold pack on the bite. Next question, if a snake bites you, you should run off the trail and rush to the hospital as soon as possible. You should stay calm, elevate the arm or leg to the level of your heart, or call 911 and seek treatment quickly. The answer here is B, C, and D. An arm or a leg You'd like to elevate it to the level of your heart. There's no reason to run down the hill to the car. You want to be trying to remain calm and either call for an ambulance or have one of your friends or family drive you to the hospital. We'll have more of our snake bite quiz with Dr. Hertner tomorrow. For your healthy family, I'm Ira Cronin. For more health stories, head to yourhealthyfamily.com.